Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another exciting episode of iRevise Guide. This is Puneet Khatri back with another video. So, in this video, we are going to talk about iPad OS 13.1. So if you aren't aware as of now, Apple has released a completely new separate OS version for the iPad. So earlier what used to happen is that your iPad was running on iOS which is a mobile operating system but henceforth there is a customized operating system for your iPad so that a lot more can be done which was not possible with iOS 13. So guys this video now we need to know that uh, iPad OS 13.1 has been released as of now. So if you are using an iPhone, you would have noticed that iOS 13 update was already there in the market after the official announcement and the official event that took place on 10th of September. But uh, iPad OS was not there released in the market as of now or to the general public. The reason was that Apple wasn't prepared, but with the launch of the new iPhones, the company had to roll out a pre or you can say a pre-stable or a properly stable version of iOS 13. That is the exact reason along with iPadOS 13.1, we have iOS 13.1 update rolling out as well. And in case you are using an iPhone, the video for iOS 13.1 will be down in the description or somewhere here on the screen as well. So guys, without wasting any bit of time, let's get right into this video to check out how to go ahead and install iPadOS 13.1 on your iPad. Alright so guys very first thing I'll recommend you to is go ahead and take a backup of your iPad so that is very very necessary to take a backup because you never know when something goes wrong while installing a particular OS version and it is definitely a good option to say stay with your data because no one likes to lose their data and that's the exact reason you should go ahead and take a backup of your iPad before going ahead with the installation process of iPad OS 13.1. So guys once you have taken a backup of your iPad I've already taken the backup if you don't know how to take a backup the article link will be down in the description you can go ahead and check out how to back up your iPad and now if we go ahead and start what you need to do is you need to have a proper internet connection with a high-speed data because the download file is somewhere around more than 3 GB so if you have a high-speed data it will help you to download the file faster rate what you need to do is go ahead and tap on settings under settings you need to scroll down and tap over general under general go on a software update and just wait for it to fetch the over-the-air update here you can see iPad OS 13.1 and all the details about the update has been mentioned over here. If you wish to read more about this update, you can tap on learn more icon or tap on the Apple link to read more about this particular update and what all's new and what all's coming up. One thing is for sure, this is the major update for iPad because the iPad OS 13.1 is the very first version of the iPad OS and I will recommend you definitely without any doubt go ahead and install this on your iPad. So how do you install this? Tap on the download icon and then it'll say that uh, update has been requested followed by the entire download file being downloaded. Once it has been downloaded, you'll have the install now icon. Just go ahead and tap on install now. Now it will ask you to enter your iPad's password. After you enter the password of your iPad, the update installation process will begin. Now you can see verifying the update. Also, one thing is recommended guys, ensure that there is a battery life of more than 50% on your iPad so that the installation process does not get stuck in between. All right, so guys, so after the entire installation process has been completed, we have the iPad again booted up. Now let's go ahead and enter the password and start the device. So let me just show you that this iPad now is running iPad OS 13.1. I'll go into ge settings, general, about, and here you can see software version 13.1 this is the ipad 6th generation that's about it guys so that's the entire way how you can go ahead and install ipad os 13.1 on your ipad and improve your productivity in a lot more manner if you want to know what all is new with the ipad os 13.1 there will be a link down in the description go ahead and tap on that link and check out everything that you need to know about the ipad os 13.1 so guys, if you enjoyed this video, you like this video and it helped you in some or the other way, please do not forget to like and comment down below. Also ensure to subscribe and share this video with a lot of your friends and family so that it motivates me to produce more such content. Also guys, if you want to share something or what are your views about iPadOS, do not forget to comment them down below. I'll be waiting for your comments and I'll ensure that I reply to every single one of them. That's about it and I'll catch you guys later in the next one. Peace out. Bye.